Hey everyone, Elliot here. Have you ever picked up your iPhone, iPad, or Apple Watch only to be met with that frustrating iPhone lock to owner message? It's officially known as the iCloud activation lock, and it can be a real headache if you're not sure how to get past it. Today, I'm going to show you ways to bypass the activation lock on your Apple devices, completely legally and safely. Now, you might have heard about sketchy services or expensive software promising to fix this issue, but trust me, there's a way better, safer, and free alternative that's quicker and guaranteed to work. Stay tuned, because by the end of this video, you'll be able to get your Apple device up and running smoothly without any hassle. Just a quick reminder, this info is for responsible use only. It's for people who own their device and just forgot their access info. We don't support or encourage breaking the law, like bypassing security on stolen devices. Respect the law and others' rights. Our video follows YouTube's guidelines and community standards. All right, let's dive right into the services that claim to help bypass the activation lock on your Apple device. Now, you might come across a bunch of options out there, but it's important to choose something that's safe, legal, and actually works. For those who legitimately own their devices and have just forgotten their access info, services like Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app, Safe Unlocks, Lock to Owner, and iUnlock app are great choices. They're known for being reliable and making the whole process smooth and straightforward. Quick backstory, a friend of mine recently inherited an old iPhone from a family member but couldn't get past the activation lock. We initially tried some sketchy online tools which didn't work and felt pretty shady. Fortunately, we found safe unlocks and it was a game changer. These tools are designed for educational purposes and to help people in genuine need. They offer a user-friendly experience, meaning you don't need to be tech savvy to get it done. Most importantly, they align with YouTube's guidelines and community standards. Now let's move on. First, open your browser on your phone or computer and go to unlockhere.com. This is an AI assistant powered web app that helps you unlock any mobile phone restriction you might have. Once you're there, let Nifty, the AI bot, know that you need an iCloud unlock by clicking on Remove Activation Lock. Next, select that you have an iPhone. But remember, you can also choose iPad or Apple Watch if that's what you need to unlock. Now, you'll need to enter the IMEI or serial number of your device. What's the difference? Well, iPhones all have IMEIs, so if you want to unlock an iPhone, choose IMEI. Some iPads and Apple Watches have IMEIs if they have a SIM card slot or cellular capability. But most of them come with just a serial number. If that's the case, enter the serial number. To find it, press the sleep button on your locked device, press it again, and tap on the I on the bottom right. It will now show your device info. Don't forget to input the device information in the next step. Enter basic info to attach the order to your account. It needs to be real info so you can receive your order confirmation you will get a confirmation code sent to your email, which you need to confirm. Check that you agree to the terms and that you don't plan on unlocking a stolen device. Tap Start Process and make sure to solve the quick CAPTCHA to prove you're not a robot. You will now get an email with a confirmation code. Don't forget to check your spam or junk folder as sometimes it lands there. Take the confirmation code and click the button to land on a page where you have to enter it and once again confirm you're not a robot. Once entered, your unlock has started and your device will be unlocked. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone lock to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone. And as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Don't worry, it'll be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again once it's finally unlocked. So it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. In this part, let's skip all the setup. Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps and just do it all later on. And there you have it. It says, welcome to iPhone. Now go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap, forget password, or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. All right, guys, here are some more alternative ways to legally remove iCloud activation lock. This is for those who own their devices and just forgot their access info. Let's explore some options that are both safe and effective. When you're stuck with an iPhone locked to the owner, it can feel super frustrating. But believe it or not, there are legal ways to get past this hurdle. One of the first steps you should take is contacting Apple support. If you have proof of purchase, Apple can often help you unlock your device. 
This method is often overlooked, but it's straightforward and reliable. It's always worth trying this route before anything else. Next, if you have access to the Apple ID and password that were used to set up the device, you can remove the activation lock by going to iCloud.com. Just log in, select Find My iPhone, and remove the device from your account. This method is simple, but it requires you to have access to the original credentials. For those who want a more direct approach, there are reputable unlocking services out there. Tools like Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app, Safe Unlocks, Lock to Owner, and iUnlock app have been known to provide reliable solutions. They offer user-friendly interfaces and guarantee results, making them a go-to option. Another overlooked method is taking your device to an Apple Store. Explain your situation and provide proof of purchase. The staff usually have the tools necessary to help you out. This method is legit and adheres to Apple's policies. Remember, these methods are here to help people who genuinely need to regain access to their devices. Respect the law and avoid anything that sounds too good to be true, because it probably is. These unlock services only work in first world countries. If you can't access the services or don't want to, we offer 250 unlocks every week for users who watch our videos. To enter, simply like this video, subscribe to our channel, and comment your device model, IMEI, and country. Once you complete these steps, you're automatically entered. That's all for now. See you in the next one.